talking about doctors. I read this on the news. She was on a plane and she wanted to be referred to as doctor and she got called miss by I guess one of the flight attendants. Look, if you have that much of an ego, if you have that much of a problem, no clue who you are. You're dressed like everybody else. You're wearing your your stupid little white jacket that doctors wear. What is with the white jacket? Can one of you nurses tell me, or doctors, if there's a doctor out there, tell me what the fuck the problem is with the white jackets? Why do you have to have the white jacket with your little name? Ooh, look at me. I get a little name tape on. Ooh, I got this made at, 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 at Office Max. I don't fucking know where they get their little name tapes made at. So you decided to go to, to college for eight fucking years? Good for you, dude. So if I see you out in public eating at Chili's, Oh, hello, ma'am. Ma'am? Don't call me ma'am. I'm a doctor. Okay, well, I don't fucking know that, nor do I care. Go away from me. Go far away from me. Okay, Michael, how you doing? Um, no, address me as staff sergeant. Excuse you? <laughs> I, didn't go to, I didn't go to college for eight years to be called ma'am. Congratulations, dude. You're a doctor. You're proud of it. You're equally as douchey as those people that get custom-made license plates. I got a custom-made license plate because I have extra money and I have extra time and nothing better to do with my life but to let other people know that my car is special. Every time I see somebody with a custom-made license plate, I just think this guy's a douchebag. This lady wanted to be called doctor, and it's like, look, the flight attendant doesn't know what you do.